How to connect Stripe payment getaway with WooCommerce. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can connect Stripe, which is a simple to use payment getaway or a payment infrastructure where you can accept payments to your WooCommerce store. So if you have a WooCommerce store or if you're running a WooCommerce website and you're selling any kind of product and you want to have a uh, payment getaway, you can simply set it up using Stripe. So to get started, you're going to have to go on to stripe.com and from here, you're just going to click on sign in over here. And once you click on sign in, you can just log into your account or create a account via your email. I have just logged into my account and it's a very simple account. It's a very simple setup. Uh, to use Stripe, you don't have to pay initially, but eventually to use WooCommerce because you are paying for WooCommerce, you're gonna have to pay for Stripe's advanced features as well. But we're gonna talk about that later. Now, before we actually go how to connect your Stripe account, you can see that you have to activate your account as well. So you have to do email verification to actually be able to use your account onto your WooCommerce integration or WooCommerce website. So make sure to activate your account. I am just doing this as a sample, so it really does not matter if my product keys or if all of the results are executed, but you do need to make sure to activate your account. Now, over here, you can set up multiple things like your payment, like you can click on create payment, you can create invoices, you can create a lot of your business data on Stripe as well. To manage the business end, instead of doing it all on WooCommerce, you can do it all on Stripe and have all of your financial data in one place. Now, you can see over here, if you're a developer, you can use this kind of publish key to uh, copy and add to your WooCommerce website. I don't recommend this for most people, mostly used by a lot of people, but if you're not used to uh, integration and if you're not used to coding or any of that, it's going to be very difficult for you to use this kind of code and add it to WooCommerce. It's a little bit of a hassle. So what you're going to do to simply connect your Stripe payment getaway to your WooCommerce store is you're just going to click on connect over here. Once you create your Stripe account, you're going to click on connect. You're going to scroll down and you're just going to click on WooCommerce over here. It's in their top partners. And now you can see over here that you have a simple uh, little setup. So you're just going to click on start now. And then you're just going to click on free download. So this is just going to open up your WooCommerce account. And then you're going to click on proceed to checkout. And now you're just purchasing Stripe. You're going to click on purchase. And this is just leading you to your WooCommerce integration dashboard. And you're just going to click on add to site. And then you're just going to select whatever site you have. So you can enter your site extension, whatever it might be. You can enter that over here and then you're gonna be ready to go. So you can download this file and uh, later on open up WordPress and then start editing your website to just customize it. But once you have basically added Stripe via that method, you can go into your WooCommerce dashboard over here. You can go into all extensions and then you can search for Stripe just to make sure that it is added. Now you can see over here, this is your Stripe plugin. And once you enter this plugin, you're going to be ready to accept payments. Now from here, you can just connect the WooCommerce store to your account and you're going to be ready to accept payments via Stripe onto your WooCommerce platform. So that is how simple and easy it is to set this up. You just have to uh, click on a few buttons and these are like automatic processes. These are automatic extensions. You don't have to set them up. You don't have to code them. Just go in your extensions and add the extension. It will automatically do these standard settings and then you can later on set up what you want and what you don't want. So you can click on your payments and all of your card management or financial management later on to further uh, detail what kind of features you want and you don't want. Now, Stripe is not limited to only uh, WooCommerce. If you have any other platform, Wix or Squarespace or any other kind of e-commerce platform that you might have, you can easily connect Stripe over there as well. So you don't have to limit it to one kind of connection. 
connection. So if I go on to Wix over here, I can also just as simply connect it with my Wix account just by clicking on get started. And then you can just log in over here and then you're going to be ready to connect Stripe. Now, what are the basic features and what is the method of Stripe that it is so much better than just using a simple payment getaway? Well, the first thing is Stripe gives you report overviews. So you can see you have your gross volumes, you have your spend per customer, issuing volume, dispute activity, dispute count, high risk payments, successful payments, new customers, and net volume for sale. So you get a very simple and easy to understand kind of reports overview with Stripe. And you can track what kind of payments you are receiving, uh, what is the like overall uh, revenue that you're generating. Then you have your balances as well. So you can see your overview reviews you can see your top ups and you can see your payouts as well so you can also set up financial information like any kind of uh, payday that you might have you can set those up on stripe as well via your business uh, revenue just to monitor and pay out expenses directly from your e-commerce revenue as well and then you also have customer and product reports that you're going to be getting uh, let's say you have a certain product that is going to cost you a lot in tax rates then you can easily manage that from your your Stripe dashboard as well and it's going to allow you to be um, more aware of certain things that might not be as profitable as you had once imagined. Now, after that, on your Stripe dashboard, you also have your report section. So over here, you have your payment reconciliations, you have revenue recognitions, you have balance, you have billing analytics, and you have radar and payment authentication. And payment authentication is probably one of their newest features and is very useful if you're running an online business and you're just starting out. You are very likely or very prone to be scammed. So having payment authentication to uh, make sure that you are getting paid for the products that you're shipping or the service that you're providing is very essential and then you also have your basic balance and pay out reconciliation and revenue recognition to be able to better manage your finances for your e-commerce store may it be woocommerce wix or any other kind of store that you have now stripe is not only available for free so if you go on to stripe and you go on to stripe.com you can click on pricing over here to see the different payment plans that Stripe has. Now, if you integrate it on uh, WooCommerce, it's available for free. You can get the free extension of Stripe, but if you want something else, then you have to pay a 2.9% uh, on the simple transaction plus 30 cents on each successful card charge. So every time uh, someone pays via their card, you will be uh, paying this little cut of that payment so whatever it is 2.9 percent plus 30 cents will be going to stripe so there are no other kind of hidden fees in stripe it's very simple other than that uh then you just have your basic kind of payment set up so you have to integrate that uh, 2.9 percent plus 30 cents into your basic product prices just to make sure that you're generating a accurate revenue so that was it for today i hope you guys found this video helpful and you're now easily able to integrate stripe into to your WooCommerce store. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel and I will catch you guys in the next video.